Let's say that instead of the number of units sold in each warehouse, you want to determine the average sales for each warehouse on a specific day. First, remove the unit sold field from the values area. Then, drag the total sales field to replace it. Now the pivot table shows the total sales in dollars for each location. Since we want to see the average instead of total, we'll need to change the summary function. On the Sum of Total Sales button, click this small icon. And then in the Summarize Buy box, click Average. The button updates to indicate that the values are now averages instead of sums. And the pivot table now shows the average sales amounts instead of totals. Currently, the pivot table shows average sales amounts for the entire month. To see averages for a particular day, drag the date field into the report filter area. And now, at the top of the pivot table, we have a filter for date, where we can filter the pivot table to show one or more days. Let's just filter to show May 5th. Now we can quickly determine the average sales per item for each warehouse on May 5th. In the next lesson, we'll format the pivot table to make it easier to read and make sure it is updated to include new or changed source data.